Daniel, Edoche, the daughter, first child of Yo Edoche, has decided once again to come out to caution her father. First born, first born. They know a lot about their parents that the younger ones might not know. Why? Because they are the ones who came first. They either came when their parents are struggling or came when their parents had that first break, you know, have that cash to say, I am a man. You're a woman. Let us settle down. If you know what I mean. Well, this time around, she has come out to say something to her father directly. And what she wrote has got a lot of people wondering. I'm talking about those who are happy. Those who are happy with this drama that is out there. This foolishness of you, Ledoche and Judy Austin. But I'm very sure that you are not part of those who are in support of the stupidity and foolishness of Yul Edoche. No one is saying that Yul Edoche cannot get himself involved in polygamy, but the manner at which he went about it and the way he's still going about it till date is what is wrong. That exactly is what is wrong. According to Danielle Yul Edoche, she wrote this. A man who chases two rats will catch none. She is simply sending a coded sentence to her father, telling her father, you are going to lose. You are a loser. And these are part of the words of wisdom that she gleaned from her grandfather. Peter Doche is a man who is known due to what he does. Um, an actor and um, an older man. He is someone who is known to interpret his role once you put him in those epic movies. He knows what to do. She picked this as a reminder to her father, a man who chases two rats. She did not say a cat. Probably that would have been much more, you know, covered. She decided to make it clear that she's referring to her father, a man like my father, Yul Edoche, a man like my father, a man who chases two rats, will catch none, will catch none. She's foretelling, she's prophesying, she's um, actually doing what a lot of us have been doing. And she is also, you know, trying to compliment and also say thank you to those who have been commenting for a while now on this subject matter. I say thank you to you also. Can you see that May and Daniela comes on this platform to read and to listen to what we say? Can you see? She is confirming what we are saying. A man who chases two rats will catch none. None at all. None at all. You, Ledoche, it's such a pity. It's such a pity. It's such a pity that... Uh, you, as the last born of the family, have decided to drag the family into this mess. Wherever you mention Edoche, the first thing that comes on your mind is this terrible, useless, foolish characteristics. Like I said, it is not about polygamy. A lot of men are polygamous. They are polygamists. Some men are polygamous in nature. Some women accept it. Some religion accepts it. Some tradition, culture accepts. It's just their way of life. But it is the way this man went about it. Particularly coming out publicly to say that my wife, May, has done nothing to me. We've been having this perfect, this and that. If it is true that she did nothing, I mean, men and women have problems. There are times that you are just trying to pamper, you are just trying to package, you are trying to make your marriage look pretty when it is not pretty. There are times that it's like that. Maybe the woman is unruly, she's this, she's that. We, we do understand all of these things and the man decides to find comfort or succor somewhere else out there. Maybe this woman is the type that nags a lot. If you refuse to say this, it's your business. But what we know that came out from your mouth, you, Leduce, is that me 
did nothing to you. She has been there. In fact, she was there when you had nothing, when there was no hope, when there was no this, when she said, all right, let's see how it goes. She was working. She had a steady job. She worked in the bank. And you, you are comfortable with that because you know monthly, money will always come in, regardless of role or no role in any movie. You know something will at least you will eat and feed yourself. Somehow you started climbing the ladder, slowly, slowly. You now feel that you are now, your stomach is big. Well, I do understand that uh, military men, truck drivers and um, transporters and actors and actresses, people who often live home for a long time due to their kind of job, they often times will have concubines out there. But I have not seen a man, maybe you have seen such, a man that will end up doing this and come out publicly to begin to misbehave and talk less and talk stupidly about his wife for not accepting his decision or his waywardness or his mistake. Come on. If you went to beg your wife and say, look, this thing has happened. She said she's not going to accept. Of course, she's saying what she wants to say. Then you cannot come on social media. You should have just kept it quiet, kept it on the low. You do not have the right to come on social media to begin to talk and say polygamy is a blessing. You just want to do this. You want to do that. You want to do this. Regardless of going secretly to pay the fake bride price, renting people, regardless of you trying to lay claim to that child that uh, you do Austin bought for you according to your tradition and culture, regardless of that, you should not. How is it your tradition that says you should come on social media and begin to rant and talk nonsense? And begin to say your wife is a stubborn woman, strong-headed wife, blah, 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 that she should have accepted, she should understand this, that it's not as if you are keeping this and that, that you just want to have this life so that when you are this, you know, it is the manner at which he went about it that created all of this. And this is the reason why his daughter, Danielle, could come up again. The other time she removed your surname, saying, I don't want to be called Yul Edoche anymore. But she was spoken to and she returned back that name. But she's still saying this, that a man who chases after two rats will catch none. Meaning, at the end of the day, you will be a loser. You are a loser. You will be a loser. If you're not careful, you will lose more than what you think. You might lose a lot. You might lose more. You might, in fact, you might just be, you know, deleted if you're not careful. Because you have seen and you have heard and you know about the passing away of your son and the mystery that surrounds it. You know all of these things. Maybe you have been promised presidency and you say, well, regardless of what anybody says, I think that seat as president of Nigeria after President Bola Metunumbu, come on, man. Be ready to face Peter Obi and the obedience. Be ready to fa face Soludo, the governor of your state in Anambra. Maybe you want to be governor of your state. It better you go and stand as a councillor in your village or in Juju Austin's village. Go and start as a councillor. Yes, go and start there. Go and learn the rudiments. Go and learn how to talk. Go and learn how to behave. Go and learn all of these things because those sacrifices or the promises that they have given to you in the kingdom of Juju Austin will not work. You are simply wasting your time. It won't work. Go and learn how to behave because you are acting stupidly. You are acting foolishly. On social media, acting foolishly. You came out talking nonsense. You, in fact, you invited us. So, it is our right to stay on your matter as long as we want. And we will not stop. We will not stop because there is a reason for this. Your daughter also brought this out again. Can you guys see? Because some people say, let us just stop about this guy. Let us just finish it once and for all. I say finish what? We are not finishing. If Look at the daughter of Yule Doche writing this. That a man who chases after two rats will lose. Will catch none. We'll have none. We'll inherit none. We'll enjoy none. This is wowless. She's saying we should not stop. She's saying we should not stop. Obviously, because her father is a shameless, immature man, 
a lily livered man, he will reply and respond to Daniela. I'm telling you the truth. You will reply. You will say something. Just watch and see. This is how crazy and desperate this man is. What are your thoughts on, about this? Like and share this video. Subscribe to this channel. See you in the next update.